Alrighty, welcome back to Tales of Berseria. In the last episode, we fought Lizard Man and cut off his tail. So now we're gonna go take it through the Ice Queen Lady. Not to the Ice Queen Lady, actually, I think we are. So that she can call off the search and so that we can get a uh, boat person for uh, to help us sail in the seas. And we also got this thingy, which we got a basically an, an escape rope, I guess. It'll just take us to the entrance of the cave, dungeon, whatever this is. Uh, but we're not going to take it because we ran into one of those kitty but cats. Cats boxes? Cats chests earlier? And I needed like 25, and I didn't have enough, and now we got 57. We have way more than enough By now, the way, so we're going to go back. How on earth did you find out where I was hiding? Luck. And a solid hunch. The village I grew up in was the dullest, gloomiest place ever. I hated it so much I became a sailor first chance I could get. But look at me now. If I could do it all again, I wouldn't abandon my home. I see. Alright, as I was saying, we're gonna get that cat's box, so we can't just escape rope out of here just yet. And I found out that they really do only give you uh, accessories, which is Is this really how you want to play me, it? Honestly. Listen, I'm being hunted too. It's only a matter of time. I can't afford sympathy. What was this? I never found out. Warp point. This will occasionally encounter warp points on the map. You can unlock it by touching them. After which, you will be able to freely travel to other warp points. Warp points you've unlocked on the same map. Near entrance. Okay, but the thing is, the thing wasn't near the entrance. I'm gonna hope that since that dude's dead now, there's no things that we have to fight. But if we do, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Honestly, we could, we could. Use the XP probably. You'll be rust on All my right. blade. Still don't remember the fucking controls, so. Uh, we're good. we're flying a flying dude, right? I should do this. Let's do X circles triangle. Disruption. I'll stop you! See this? Disruption! Disruption! See this? Slow down! Slow down! See this? Slow down! Is that all you got? Nice! Disruption! See this? Disruption! Your style is really unique. Just wait until I pull out the good stuff. Wait until you pull out that sword. Alright, so as far as I know, it's not a good thing to use the same move in, in a row that starts doing less damage, I think. Which is why it took forever to kill those damn bats, because I just kept using the same move, basically. Same thing Don't with these guys, time. I gotta use different things Let's on them. You. I can't just keep using the same move over and over again. Uh, so we need to use something that hits crustaceans. So we could go with this. This. Let's go with this. Let's go with this one. Since this one needs to be used more, I think. Let's go X. X square. X square X. Fuck. 
Fuck. Fuck. Don't remember the move for the fucking thing already for the bats. Um, it was X, X circle triangle. Sorry to cut you down. I'll end this quickly. That was cool. I think I'm getting a bit better, maybe. I, I did some cool things on that octopus. I'm trying to talk more and not focus so much. I'm trying to figure out how to... How to do cool things. What was that damn cat's chest? They don't show up on the map, do they? Maybe I should have just taken the warp point. Maybe it was closer to the entrance than I think it was. I'll end this quickly. That was fucking cool. That was fucking cool. Compassion from me. That was nice. Alright, I think I get it a bit. I just gotta push buttons. <laughs> um <clears throat> I, the thing is, like, when I get more than, when I get, like, up to, like, five souls, I just don't even know what does what anymore. When it's, like, three or four, I kind of can figure it out, but after that, it's just me just pushing buttons. I don't really pay attention after that. Man, what was that damn... Let's fight this octopus. You'll be rust on my blade! Disruption! Disruption! I got you! Oh, oh, stop. See this? I won't improve it's getting by easier. fighting weaklings. It's getting easier. That's a lie, you will improve from fighting weaklings. Weaklings. It's called experience, boy. Very valuable resource. That I didn't take advantage of in the last episode because I was in a rush to get to the boss. I'm gonna hope the cat's chest I saw is in here somewhere because otherwise... It is lost to time. It was at a save point, I think. I just don't remember where. Where the fuck was it? Mm. 
Ah, shit. On to battle. I'll stop you. Nope. I'll stop you. Disruption. Please. I think I passed the stupid cat's chest. If I did, I'm going to run back. Just not on, not on screen. I'll do it off screen. <laughs> or I'll take a fast route point or something. Because it's kind of upsetting that I can't remember where it was, and I don't think it was all the way over here. I feel like I saw it like near the, near the boss room. No, I'm a liar. And I have terrible memory. It's right here. Hello. You found the cats. Rose corsage. Nice. I don't know if the escape room gets used up, and if it does, I think I'm gonna hold on to it. Ah, uh, it's one or the other. What's better, Nana? Nana? What's better? The the corsage or the hat? The corsage? Yeah? The glasses or the hat? The glasses? Ooh, I know. I'll put the hat on him. Perfect. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. I don't know if I want to escape, use the quote-unquote escape rope yet, because I don't know if it gets used up or if it's just something that I can do whenever I want. I don't even know what button it was. Yeah, see? I only have one. I don't know if I can buy more. I probably can, but... I think I'd rather just walk out. Can go that way. Actually, I think I can. I'm an idiot. Actually, let me fight this octopus. I'll end this quickly. See this? No. Slow down. <laughs> See this? No. Oh, See this? The power. I got you. See this? You won't get away. Destruction. Destruction. Slow down. See this? See this? See this? Destruction. Oh yeah, I think I'm getting Sorry better. Sorry to catch you down. <laughs> I think I'm getting a bit better. Just a bit. I see some improvement. That was fun. I didn't even know you could do uh, two break souls in at the same time. Not at the same time, but like one right after while you're in it. Do one while you're in it. Let's do a quick save here. Alright, I gotta go back to the shipping guild. Do I gotta take the long way around? Can I just hop off here? Ah! That's why I couldn't get up. There's a rock in the way. Here I come! Demi human. Uh, I don't think he has any, any elemental weaknesses. Uh, let's go with the Searing Edge to a Rising Moon. Good. 
Okay, so we're gonna go triangle, circle, circle. Deception. See this? I'll stop. See this? Nice. They were nothing. Get out me way. Oh wow. I don't think I was supposed to get those. <laughs> I think I was supposed to go the other way around and grab them, but. They didn't really think that through, did they? Or maybe they did. Maybe they wanted to be nice to me. I knew it. I didn't come up there the first time. I don't know why I thought I did. Oh, they just keep respawning. I don't have to worry about running out then. That's good. Flamestone chip. Another save point. No point. We just saved a little while ago. Jesus. They need to give me more fast travel points. Can't have me running around the damn place all over the all the time. Can I walk through the front entrance now? I can. Oh well, this is never the front entrance to begin with. The front entrance is the one outside that I can't get through. That's how I got here originally. I think I walked through there. All right, sirs. I've dealt with this your is lizard Dara's man. Tale. Did you... did you really kill him? We found him dead in the Lake of Tar. This is all we could bring back. Is that so? You can doubt me all you like, but I brought you the demon's body. Who else can say that? True enough. Good. Get to work on my ship then. I'm afraid Damn. we can't. We still need Lady Teresa's permission first. Then I'll I'm go in to a her. hurry. It would be much worse for you if she knew who the real smugglers were. You wouldn't! It's a trade. Repair the ship on the beach, and I'll sail away quietly. Very well. I'll find you your shipwrights. We'll see you at the shore. Hey, Velvet. This would be a perfect opportunity for us to upgrade our equipment. How about it? Maybe. What are you talking about? You don't know? We didn't have anything like that in our village. All the more reason, then. Come on, let's go. Hey, you don't need to be so pushy. Just follow That's the just man. how I am. Get used to it. Come on. I gotta set up his stupid arts too. I'll do that off screen sometime. So I need to try him out. Can't just play Velvet all the time. Ah! With the novice smith's ace right? That's right? You can now enhance and dismantle equipment and shops. Enhancing a piece of equipment will improve its parameters and provide a chance of activating an enhancement bonus. You can obtain the materials necessary for dis for enhancing for enhancement by dismantling equipment. Let's start by enhancing a piece of equipment. Let's select enhance from the menu. Blood blade, a list of equipment that can be enhanced is displayed on the left. The materials required for the enhancement are displayed on the lower left in order to perform the enhancement. Oh, in order to perform the enhancement, you must have all the required materials. I don't know how to read. In addition to materials, you also need gold, gold to enhance equipment. The gold needed is displayed on the lower right. I never noticed that it's called gold. I thought it was just called the gold the whole time. Gold is needed displayed on the lower right. If you don't have enough gold, you won't be able to perform the enhancement. Since this is your first time enhancing, you can enhance a blood blade for free. Please select blood blade from the equipment list. Enhance. Enhancement bonus. Damage against stunned foes plus 10%. Because of the enhancement, your blood blade has improved, and its enhancement level is now displayed with a plus one at the end of the item's name. Additionally, the enhancement bonus triggered, giving it a new skill. The limit for enhancing, the limit for enhancement levels depends on the Aserite used. The novice smith's Aserite allows you to enhance items up to plus three. With other Aserite, you can enhance an item up to plus ten. Open a piece of equipment. Once a piece of equipment has been fully enhanced, its name will change and become gold. The amount and quality of materials needed to enhance an item increase with its rarity and the number of times it has already been enhanced. Higher quality enhancement materials can be gained by dismantling enhanced equipment. Through this cycle of enhancing and dismantling, you can create more powerful weapon equipment. I was going to say weapons. Now try dismantling equipment. Choose dismantle from the menu. 
<laughs> They're gonna make me dismantle the blood blade I just upgraded. <laughs> A list of your equipment is displayed on the left side of the screen. Equipment that can be dismantled appears in the white in white. Items that are currently equipped or locked appear in gray and cannot be dismantled. When you select a piece of equipment for dismantle- Well, they did make me do it for free, so it's not like I lost anything. If anything, I'm gaining something by dismantling this. When you select a piece of equipment for dismantling, the list of materials you will gain by dismantling that item will appear on the lower left. I'll try dismantling the blood plate plus one. <laughs> it's so funny though. By dismantling the blood blade plus one, you received bronze scrap, odorless fluid, and coarse tempering powder. The dismantling the materials you gain from dismantling a piece of equipment depend on the enhancement level of that equipment as well as the skills attached to it. This ends the tutorial on enhancing and dismantling equipment. Use these techniques well to make your characters stronger than ever. And that's how it's done. Get it? I suppose. It seems like kind of a hassle. Uh, maybe at first, sure. But once you get it down, it'll be second nature. You'll eventually learn how to maximize your personal strengths through wise upgrading and dismantling. It does seem useful. Right? If you plan to continue your crusade, upgrading may give you the edge you need. Of course, those who are inadequately prepared for battle probably won't end up on the winning side. That's certainly true enough. And hey, if it'll make me stronger, I'm sure I'll figure it out. If it'll help me take him down. Alrighty, give me a second real quick. I think I need to... I'm gonna do something real quick. Alright, I had left my TV audio on, I didn't want there to be an echo or anything, or the game to be heard twice, so... Can I enhance the things that I have on me right now? Uh, why don't I have that equipped? That's so much better than what I have on right now. I bought these things and I never equipped them, I think. I don't have um, any hearts that absorb HP, so that's kind of useless. Uh, you should definitely have that equipped. And like, I don't lose anything from equipping that one. Hang on. Yeah, I just gain. I don't lose anything from equipping this. Uh, maybe I should do HP or defense. I don't know. I don't. It doesn't look like I gain that much HP, so I'll do defense. Void ring is mastered. Let's do this one. I should buy myself some new... Some new arm... Some new chest stuff. That's mastered. HP is 8% or lower. Uh, that doesn't seem that great, honestly, but I'll equip it anyways. What? Multiplier is martial arts damage by 1.8. Oh. Increase stagger duration of arts based on the star level. That doesn't seem... that seems pretty good. Uh, what you got? What you got? Nothing that really 
appeals to me. Except for maybe that. Oh no. Yeah. Well, it doesn't lose that much defense. I don't think the HP is worth it though. I'll just enhance something. I'll see if I can enhance something. Alright, what can I enhance here? Uh, I have the amber fragments to do it. Ooh, I can dismantle the old one that I had. Not so. Dismantle. Doesn't cost anything to dismantle anything, right? Doesn't seem like it. And a new title, Menu Maven. Uh, increases power of art space on their star level. True Velvet increases staggered duration of art space on their star level. Effective prowess is reduced by 40%. Increases all grades art space on their star level. Each recovery and dating phones. 50. Damage reduction while stunned increases by 25%. Enemy stun duration increased by 1.1 times percent. Damage reduction while guarding increased by 25%. Effective burn reduced by 40%. Decreases cost of Solgri, cost of our star level. Capability versus beast 8%. Uh, increase, increases stagger duration of arts based on their star level. Capability versus the Potus plus 10%. What the fuck are those? Honestly, I just don't want to keep this one. Maybe I'll change it to this. So I do a bit more to the beasts, I guess. Doesn't sound too bad. The health thing was nice, but I don't really... It's not necessary. <clears throat> You want to talk? We're lucky the snow has been white for the past few years. Why is that lucky? Snow is always white. Wrong. Red ass snow. Hades, black it ass isn't always. snow. Depending on the direction of the wind and what the volcano is up to, black volcanic snow. ash can mix in with the snow and turn it gray. Oh, there's a well, volcano I was close. nearby. I was close. It's actually quite a ways up north, but it's the biggest volcano in all of Midgand. Mount Killaraus, it's called. And that's where we mine our flame stone. Actually, it's the only place you can mine the stuff. Hmm. Mount Killeraus. It's got a nice ring to it. You ever seen a volcano, Velvet? No. Of course not. And I'm not interested. That's not too bad of a take, honestly. I mean, why would you want to go near a volcano? Where am I supposed to go? Return to the grounded ship. There's nothing else I need here, right? Right. Well, it looks like we'll get the repairs we need. Maybe, but that's only half of our problem. Without a proper crew, we'll wind up shipwrecked again. Nonsense. We don't have time to find one, and we can't hire a ship without permission. We'll just have to do what we can. But we've seen where my sailing skills get us. I'm not forcing you to come. I'll do it alone if I have to. I wonder You're if there not are a any sail? free sailors around. I thought the whole point was that you made him sail because you don't know how to.
Sorry about that, my glasses were fogged up. Man, these things are respawning, it's just great. Could I just leave the area and just keep farming them? That'd be wonderful. I'd never have to worry about not having stuff for the for those cats' chests. Let's not go up to that time, that just seemed like a waste of a t waste of time. Let me just walk up to him and back him. I forgot to turn off notifications. I'm a buffoon. Let me do that real quick, actually. All right, that's been dealt with. Let's go back. Uh, where was our ship again? I don't actually remember. It was down here, right? Because we were hiding behind this rock and then we saw that dude that took our compass. XP, we could use it. You'll be rust on my blade. Uh, what's the combo again? Camera zoom. Wow. That's neat. Okay, uh, we need something that has... Demi-human. So we're gonna do... Triangle... Circle, circle. Why is it automatic? When did I turn it auto? Damn, the thing was even there. You won't get any pity or compassion from me. Great is an assessment of your performance in battle. The better your style, the better your result will be. The amount of proficiency earned for master skills after battle is governed by grade, so aim for the best scores. I didn't even know what my grade was. I wasn't even paying attention to it because I didn't even know that was a thing. Ah, oh, you stupid bird. Come on, really? Where's my grade? Where's my grade? Where's my grade? 1.02. I don't know if that's good or bad. You'll be rust on my blade. I'll cut down anyone in my way. One point zero one did worse that time. Hey, Velvet, do the demons you kill turn back into humans? No, huh? not at all. What are you talking about? Not at about? all. Remember they end the up demon in my stomach, that attacked bro. us near the coast? When it died, it turned back into a human. Every demon I've killed has stayed a demon. So, I was just wondering what was different. Do demons stay demons when they die? But what about Nico and the villagers I killed? 
Maybe it's just Pot a twist. case by case sort Maybe of they're thing. not dead. Who Maybe cares? I just sucked the demon out a of them. A corpse is a corpse, whether it's human or demon. Yeah. I guess being human again doesn't help much if you're already dead. Exactly. All that matters is that the demons I devour make me stronger. Nothing more. She says that, but it'd be cool if, like, every time I devoured a demon in a cutscene, like a bigger demon, like I got their power or something. Like that dragon. Like, it would have been sick if I got, like, this fireball. I know I got Searing Edge, but, like, let me shoot a fireball. Because, like, who doesn't want to do that? <laughs> That'd be sick. I just summon the arm, and then I get, like, this big-ass fireball. I mean, I guess I do that with that one electric move. That's not too far off, I guess. But it's not a fireball. I want to shoot a fireball, like, how I burn that dude's face off. She's hopeless. Her keel's busted. It'd be faster to build a new ship. Her keel? You could say she's like a man with a broken back. And how in blazes did you end up running aground here? I wouldn't think it possible. If you can't help, that's enough. Go back to town. What now? Do we try to find a new ship? I can't think of anything else. I just hope we have time. You hate to hear it. Oh, Empyrean Enominat, hear my prayer. Blessings and honor unto thee. This frail flesh a sacrifice to be thy foundation. Sister. Oh, Oscar! What brings you here? Oh, that's the dude whose face Your I fucking face. burned. What happened to you? A demon got the better of me. I've been summoned back to the Abbey, but I thought I'd stop by on my way. My... my poor brother. I'm so sorry. There is pain, but I can still fight. Mm -hmm. The scar will serve to remind me of my inexperience. An underhanded foe, no doubt. No, he just... No. The demon saps her enemy's strength with her left hand and turns it against them. It was a girl That's impossible, with black hair, I turned off notifications. Of fire. She poses a threat for even a seasoned Praetor. Please, take care, dear sister. Damn, she remember just from the fucking description. It was her! Teresa? Understood. I will. Worry not. A failure as minor as this is not the end of the world. To be honest, oh, he, I came hoping you'd set me up like that. One eye. Well, I do believe I recognize those earrings. Of course. I treasure them dearly. Thank you. They suit you just as well as I thought they would. I must take my leave now. Lady Teresa, we've captured a stowaway. I wasn't stowing away, you twit. I merely boarded without permission. They fucking caught her. Good job. Damn, jeez. You. You're a collaborator with that demon woman. Where is she? <gasps> Your tortures are useless against the mighty Mugilu. Because I'll spill my guts just fine without him. Ah. Oh. Jeez, thanks a lot. She wanted to get back at the people who betrayed her, but then she goes right around and does the same thing to us. Fuck you too, Magilu. Fight me, bird. Don't get overconfident. See this? See this? Nope. Ow, I can't block. Fuck, dude, oh my god. Well then, let's that move on. That was sloppy. Point fifty six, yeah. That was sloppy. Stupid birds, man.
Always ready to fight. Jesus Christ. 1.03. Damn, I annihilated them. Alright, let me pass. Let me pass. Oh, I'm gonna get stopped like right here, aren't I? There was word from the Abbey. They're holding a public execution for a witch who tried to draw demons into the city. Is that so? <laughs> Sounds like a real nasty character. I'd stay away from the city if I were you. It's a common tactic for Lady Teresa. Threaten one criminal to draw out their allies. Are you saying I'm a criminal? Pot calling the kettle black, isn't it? That's why I'm warning you. Lady Teresa's top class, He's even like, among exorcist praetors. <laughs> I wouldn't think badly of you if you fled. A witch? It has to be Mogilu, huh? It looks like the Abbey is on to us. We'd best assume they've already found the tunnel. No sense trying to buy a ship now. Then don't buy one. Steal it. Steal a ship from Helavis. Just the two of us. We have at least one other on our side. Dial? He said he can navigate. If he joins forces with us, all the better. That could be. But what happens to Mogilu? Fucker. I suppose that's up to the Abbey. Unless you gave them false Let's info. Head to Dial's cave. In that case, she Sorry, may not Mogilu. be so bad. Rest in peace. <laughs> I'll end what? This quickly. No, he got up to me. I'll stop you. Stop you. Oh my god, I hate these birds. Oh my god, let me finish my combo, bro. There we go. Come on, really? Man. There's a fast roll point around the beginning, right? So I can just go straight to the end. I hope. I realize that I forgot to make this 60 FPS, which kind of sucks. But oh well. It's not like the last episode of 60 FPS. I'll be sure to do it next time. Forgot to set it on OPS. It's my bad. <laughs> there is a uh, thingy here. Wonderful. Oh. Remote play was dying. Alright. You really go all out, don't you? What do you mean? Look, you're using Dial, threatening the guild, abandoning Mogilu. You see? I'm not abandoning her. She can take care of herself. Nothing stops you, does it? There's a lot I don't understand about Mogilu, but I know she won't be killed so easily. Besides, I'm sure she's already told the Abbey everything she knows about us. Yep. You're probably right. That means we need an ace up our sleeve. Like a demon they believe to be dead. All right, one left. <sighs> Straight Do your blades died. need sharpening too? I'd be happy to take play. care of it for you if you want. No thanks. I was taught never to leave my lifeline in the hands of another. Sure. Sounds like you found a good teacher. <sighs> I don't care if it's me who does it, as long as you're keeping them well maintained. Just in case you don't already know. After you sharpen your blades, you should rub them with clove oil and wipe them down with wool. Yeah, I know. I was taught that too. By the man who killed my brother.
We just go straight ahead. Plot twist, they're already here. They already killed Dial. Hello. So your tail hasn't grown back yet. What are you two doing back here? Things didn't work out. We'll lend a hand with your raid. <laughs> Awfully presumptuous, aren't you? I'm a demon. Comes with the territory. <laughs> you got me there. Ah, oh, gods. I think that's the first time I've laughed since turning demon. But are you sure? It's suicide, you know. Maybe not. I have a plan. The exorcists have a hostage they're using to lure me into the city. Hmm. Then we can sneak in through the tunnel into the storehouse. No. I expect they'll have an ambush ready there. So instead, we hit them with a direct frontal assault. You call that a plan? No. I call it a feint. As their forces converge on the front, a second group slips in via the tunnel, strikes the docks, and secures a ship. After that, the two groups meet up and we all sail away. And I want you at the helm. Answer me this, then. Who's making this frontal assault of yours? I will, naturally. That works? When? Tomorrow. Can we rest here until then? Make yourself at home. Nothing so comfy as a bed of tar. <laughs> right. Velvet? Hey, Velvet? Uh, Muffy? You were crying out. Were you having a nightmare? Bye bye. Oh, Luffy, it was hmm? terrible. Bye bye, Nana. Come on, let go of me. I have to Andale, go. More enthusiasm. I have something important to do. What's that? Arthur told me to come meet him at the Shrine of Tranquility. <laughs> no, Luffy said no. Listen to me. Are you the glasses? Right? You were tossing and turning. I'm fine. It was just a dream. If you don't want to go with me, I understand. That wouldn't do. How can I repay you if you die? You are an odd one. Indeed. Am I? I always thought of me as just me. Velvet, who's this Artorius? My target. He killed my brother. We're ready. Dial should be at the entrance. Let's get going then. All right, I can just fast travel, right? Sleep well? Just fine, thanks. And your special concoction? Ready for deployment anytime. By the way, I never caught your name. Velvet. We'll sail together if you live, Velvet. If not, at least I know what to put on your tombstone. You've got a sharp tongue. <laughs> I've always been that way. Right then, we're off to attack Helavis. Ah, more dialogue. That reminds me. Where do you think that boy who took the compass ran off to? Helavis, I'd imagine. Since Malakim are always tethered to exorcists. That means we might run into him during our attack. Are you getting squeamish about killing the boy because you feel indebted to him for healing you? No. If he gets in the way, I'll take him down. But... But? I have to remember to thank him first. Right. And then Does that bother you at all? Thank him while the sword's inside of no, his chest. not really. I just know that Malakim don't taste very good. Malakim don't suit your palate? I'll call that a positive.
Are we actually going to the front this time? Yeah, we are. Who goes there? Oh, I'm pretty sure you were expecting me. Person. <laughs> Not even human or anything, just person. Alright, I can use anything on them. Ow. I unleashed all my power. Maybe I overdid it. Combo bonus effect. Martial arts reduce soul gauge costs. Hidden arts increase chances to inflict status effects. Malik arts increase stagger time. Break soul increase damage. The break soul effect is especially large. Performing a mystic arc after multiple break souls will deal devastating amounts of damage. Well, you never told me what the fuck a mystic art is. Hello? Did I miss a fucking tutorial? Mystic Arts? I never got a fucking Mystic Arts tutorial. You can't just mention something you never taught me about. What? Hell of these. The townspeople are gone. I was right. It's a trap. We're gonna have a showdown in the middle of the, middle of the city. Middle of the town. Just gonna break everything. Sup? Let me eat y'all. Wow! Look who actually showed up to rescue me! Oh, you're more of a softie than I ever gave you credit for, demon lady! You're here! You're the demon that escaped the island? What if I am? You hurt my dear Oscar. You will pay for that. Slowly. Well, it was either I hurt him or I die. You think I was gonna be okay with dying? Come and face me then, exorcist! I am honor bound to aid her. Beware her left arm! Oh, that was a new move. That was a new one. Oh, wow, I'm in the dodge. Fire and water come. See this? See this? Oh, I like that attack. Is this all you've got? A pair of demons should be simple for you. I like that attack. <laughs> I didn't even know I had that one. Who wants to taste my blade next? You fiends! All exorcists, form up! Oh, 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 oh. Deception! Next! It's just, it keeps doing that move despite what I finish with, so I'm assuming that maybe it just does it based on whatever you're fighting? I don't think that's true. I admire your endurance, but you will regret this soon enough. Number two. 
the boy. She moved the same thing I hit the boy. You can't finish your own work. Coward. I won't fall for your taunts. That arm of yours is too dangerous. Besides, to dispose of demon filth, one ought to use an appropriate tool. Well, I've got tools of my own. Tools of flamestone, sulfur, and oil. Those will explode. Yes, they will. What? Our store is a flamestone! Vegeet? Uh, Rokuro! I'm with you! Hey! Aren't you forgetting someone? <laughs> nah, fuck you. What are you all doing? After them! Lady Teresa! The ships! The port! It's all on fire! <laughs> Orderlies, put out the fires at once! This plan's going pretty well. Move it! We're ready to set sail! <laughs> oh, we're not done, are we? I won't let you escape. It looks so sad. Never. <clears throat> you deceitful snake. I'm a demon. Spare me your sins, then you can pay with your life. It's just her now. Uh, do I got a move that does some good stun? Could hit her with one of these and then circle. I just need a stun. Give me a stun. Out of my way. Ow. Oh, she's not down. Oh my god, I'm so glad I blocked that. As exorcist Praetor Teresa, I give you this order. Do it, number two. Don't even have names, bro. The kid's gonna blow himself up. To think you were a demon. The crybaby exorcist. I wasn't crying. Two praetors. Not looking good. Uh, 
Knock them back. That's an order. Knock them back, or I'll eat you. An order? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. Why am I taking him with me? Why? Why would they do such a thing to us? We're finished! Helavis is no more! Curse you. Curse you. Such ghastly demons. The Abbey, no. Lord Artorius himself must be informed. Fuck Artorius. All my homies hate Artorius. That went well. Lost some health there. That man is at full health. How? With pal I didn't read what's With Paladin's Ventite Soul Charge, guard it continuously for 1.5 seconds to gain dirty soul gauge. Oh, if I guard for full for a second and a half, I get some soul gauge back. Oh, what the fuck? No, that doesn't help me at all. Oh, I guess it'd make the diamonds come back quicker, which isn't bad. Some enemies, some enemies increase in strength of a certain other enemy is present on the battlefield. This effect is called a power link. You can break power links by defeating the appropriate enemies. Power links often appear on reinforcements, so don't underestimate your foes, even if they are low level. Hey, he actually came with us. Well, that turned out better than I expected. Though we wound Her up face. with a little extra. Extra? Did you not realize you brought him with you? Hmm. <laughs> he looks like he'd be a scrumptious midday snack for you. A snack? She's just teasing. No. If that's an order, I accept it. Should we really be taking this kid along? His arts will be useful to us. And we can always get rid of him. Precisely. Malakim are tools. Use them and ditch them. Isn't that right, number two? Yes. <laughs> She's not a fan of that. Oh, well, let me save. Alright, thank you. Earned a new title, Child of the Wild. I suppose it goes on the kid, but not on me. That makes sense. Let's see. You seem busy. We need more hands. We have to set our course and tie down the cargo. I've unfurled the sails. Does that not look safe to you? Sure. As long as it doesn't come loose. <laughs> now that was a right old conflagration. Don't think they'll be chasing after us anytime soon. You certainly didn't leave them much of a port, though. I wonder if the town will ever recover. How much did you tell them? I had just started episode two, Magilu's Fury, wherein the beautiful witch is captured and tortured by a demon most cruel! I'm starting to see why they wanted to execute you. <laughs> Look forward to putting on episode three, Magilu and the Tears of the Demon Lord. I both hate her and love her. It's strange. Hmm, I'm pretty good at cutting stuff, but tying things together is hard for me. Our destination is Logris. Set a course. I'll do what I can, but this vessel really needs a bigger crew. We need to hire more men. Besides, if we keep sailing this way...
There's no use in thinking about it. There's no turning back at this point. I talked to the boy. Velvet! How's our heading? This is so hard to read. Actually, you're holding it wrong. It's built to function even if the ship is rolling. Huh? Velvet! The heading's fine! Kid, what's your name? Number two. Not that. Your real name. Surely you have one. How unfortunate. I'll give you one. Wanna hold it? Uh, if that's an order... I'm asking you what you want. So you're ordering me to answer? Uh, right, right. You Malachim would destroy yourselves as long as it was an order, wouldn't you? That is our purpose. You really are tools. In that case, keep your mouth shut. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, fire the compass! Pirates! That flag! It's got to be Ifrit's pirate crew! They've got a bead on us, folks! And in case you hadn't noticed, we aren't really equipped for sea combat! Aren't you a witch? Can't you, like, throw spells at them or something? Be useful! To land, then! We can fight them there! Let me board the ship. Let me start throwing fireballs at them. Huh. Well, look at that. They really are a bunch of demons. That works in our favor. You knowingly pick fights with demons? Must have a death wish. You're in trouble now that we're on land. Wipe them out, number two. That's an order. Whoa there. We're not the one you'll be fighting. Are you afraid? Thank you. Close the door. Where the hell are you? It'll be me. A Moloch? No. I'm the Reaper. Alright. Is he Pirate Moloch? What is this guy? Unknown. If I just hit him with whatever I can, I guess. A Moloch pirate? A sword, twin blades, and paper. No pendulum that I can see. Deception! Hold them! Here he goes! Blow them! How's that? Ow. Deception! Here he goes! How's that? Deception! All stop! Let's go! Deception! 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 Let's go! Deception! 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 This guy's interesting. You passed the test. Join us. Sorry? Well, aren't you the impudent one? Says the demon who torched Televis. You knew about that? I hope you realize we're doing you a favor. If you'd stayed on that course, you would have smashed right up against the gate of Vortigern. 
You guys are headed for Midgand, aren't you? That means you're gonna have to go through the Narrows up ahead. But the kingdom has a massive fortress there built to defend them, with a tremendous gate. A fortress. If this is true, I like how his hair clips through the fucking hat. We desire to pass through as well, but we lack the strength. I propose we form a partnership. I'd be a fool to blindly trust the words of a pirate. Do you really want to see the gate for yourself? We won't stop you. We'll even throw you a nice funeral if you like. So what? We're allowed to refuse? Your business is your business. And ours is ours. There's nothing more to say. Can't argue with that. But first mate, y you can't go alone. We'll all come with you. You'd only get in the way. Stick to the plan and focus on your duties aboard the Von Eltia. Level up. Demonic duelist. Elementalist. Daredevil's Ventite, Pirate Eye Patch. Daredevil's Ventite allows. Oh no! I didn't get to read any of those. Molochart's offer powerful wide area attacks and healing skills, but require time to cast. The damage is affected by the user's art attack and the target's art defense. Holding the button assigned to a Molochart will alter the timing at which it is unleashed. Molochart's can be chained into combos. Higher combo. Well, that was a terrible reading. Higher combo counts reduce the casting time, so it can be effective to lead into them with martial and hidden arts. You can cancel a Molochart by tapping L1 twice. Stronger the foe, the lower chances of inflicting added effects. But there are ways to improve these chances. For example, exploiting enemy weaknesses, trying to inflict status ailments on stunned enemies, trying to stun enemies affli afflicted by status ailments. Trying to stun enemies afflicted. Okay. Lower enemies' abilities and try to inflict the corresponding status ailments. Use break souls and other methods of guard breaking. If you pa possess the Daredevil's Ventai and earn high grade in consecutive battles in the same location on normal and higher difficulties, a rare, highly dangerous enemy may enter the fray. They are called dire foes because other foes are invincible in their presence. They are a challenge to defeat. They can be fled from. Achieve victory against these fearsome opponents and you will earn valuable items, piles of gold, and tons of grade. Dire foes appear more often if the battle difficulty is higher. Hard has five times the chance of normal, more grade has been earned. Based on the average based on the average across recent battles, more battles have been fought in the area. Oh, those are the different ways that they can spawn. Okay. Searching in areas you have outgrown may be helpful as well. Share play is dying. Thank god we're probably gonna end the episode soon anyway. Consummate Collector. Okay, I think we should end the episode here. We've recorded a fair bit amount. Fair bit amount. We've recorded a fair bit. So, uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more, subscribe. And if you liked it, please give me a like. And maybe share it to people. Thank you. Goodbye.